And now, I also. All right, so Minecraft does stop, except if I lose, you know, I'm doing that's correct. If I, yeah, okay. What I'm trying to say is Minecraft death stop and Minecraft whatever, except if I die, the game is over, and that's a good game, and I will end the stream. Yeah, no, no, that's what I'm trying to say. Minecraft death swap or whatever, except if I die, I end the live stream. So there we go, guys. Let us quickly just obtain ourselves some quick things. I am live on YouTube, yes. For now, I am at least. And here we go. We're just gonna grab ourselves some. Let's get going. What is this? I'm breaking one. Wow. All right. So I'm hoping to find a shipwreck because that'll give me some iron. And yep. Is this a shipwreck? Probably not. So guys, this is pretty easy. I can use this shipwreck stuff to get me some fast iron. I don't see anyone nearby, which is good. Oh yeah, way too easy. Any doors down here? No, no doors. Alright. So I can use a button to break any suffocating blocks. I could use the water bucket to let me breathe forever if they're trying to drown me. I can use the water to cool me off if they throw me in lava. And I can use the water bucket to clutch. So against most early game forms of death, I should be protected and all that good stuff. Um. I got 10 seconds. So maybe I'll just go underwater and see if I can trap someone underwater. Any one block caves around here? Oh, never mind. Okay, here we go. 3, 2, 1. Woo! Water bucket clutch be like. Okay, great. Well, that's good. Yep. Let us collect some fast, easy blocks using shears. Look at this, guys. I use shears. I mine up a bunch of this stuff. And kaboom. Now I got myself literally a stack of, like, leaves. Isn't that crazy? A stack. I'm hoping to kill some sheep. I'm hoping to kill some sheep. Because if I can kill some sheep, I can make a banner. What's good about banners is that if you're in a lava pit, you can just place them down directly below you and block up the lava that's trying to get to you. What's good about that versus like, you know, using doors is, um, never. But unfortunately with doors, you gotta like make sure there's space for the door. But speaking of door, I probably should prepare for that eventuality by crafting some doors. Oh, never mind, he died. What was this one? What was the potion effect? Let me see. Move the advancement. Oh my gosh. Whatever. Well, I guess I won. Okay. GG. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. We're gonna try again. So, I won by doing nothing. So, I'm pretty much just Luigi. Anyways, that was a great example of awesome early game progress because I got myself awesome early game progress. I got iron, I got blocks, and... Okay. Ooh, yes, great. Immediately, right off the bat, I have food and blocks that I can use to clutch with, which is... Uh, great. So that's great early game. Food and blocks to clutch with. For example, if I'm gonna jump down here... Yee! Ah, look at that. Took no fall damage. Amazing. I'm just too good at this game. I can even jump down here and fine. Oh, you just gotta hold right click and it works! Okay, now I'm trapped in a pit. Okay, whatever, alright. One second. Flash... Flash forward. Okay, so I am now out of the pits. Amazing. Time to go get some wood, I think, is a great idea. And then we can get our, like, a shovel, and then another shovel. And I'm just gonna get crafting. So let's see, how many blocks is that? Okay, I think if he wants to manually mine out all this sand, I think it'll probably take him a while. I, I don't know why this happened. 
So on top of it, I will I will go in here and I will break this and then the same will fall. Great. Let me up, please. Oh, he's making he's getting stone tools. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm just placing all the sand so that he suffocates from the sand. Then to get back down off of this tower, I'm gonna use my boat. And I'm gonna hope he doesn't try to do a fall damage trick, and hopefully he suffocates to death. As long as I have infinite time, and I'll get infinite time if I don't die, I'll be able to survive. And he will automatically die, because he just admitted to me he does not know how to solve a suffocation trap. Now here's what I'll do. I'll go on in here. I will break this block right here, right before I'm about to go. And here we go. To go. And here we go. I'll place a boat. I'll try to place a boat. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Yes! Yes! Easy! Get suffocated, bro! <laughs> There's a lava pit! You should have jumped into this. I don't know if I could have clutched. I could have tried to like, place a boat on the edge somewhere. It would have been really difficult for me to place a boat. Where'd the boat go? Oh. See, the boat would have burned in the lava. I could have tried placing a door. He's alive? Okay. Watch this, I can place a door? Okay. Alright, well, <laughs> see how tricky it is? Even if you place a door, you can't really stop the lava. Yep, he tried to jump into the lava, but it didn't work. Anyway, so, I did die, so, GG, my stream ends. Yep, I died, so that's the end of the game. So, all in all, this live stream included a couple death swaps, in which people didn't even die because of the traps, people just died casually for no reason.